to be scouted. Originally, TS, he's hanging back, but he's going to get jumped on. Aggressive push forward out of B main into the lobby. Ana managed to find TS. Meteor will take out the enemy jet. But... Meteor there, half health. Thinking about pushing around, use the turret to kind of check the corner. Lawrence on a great angle, catches the headshot into X. Yeah, does. Gets that recon bolt off CD. Throws it into market just to be able to get that scout. Yeah, this crossfire setup. Oh, they spot one pushing forward. Right click comes in, but doesn't get the kill. Has to go for the reload. Oh, can't quite line it up. Hate will find hand. Udotan being very, very cautious. That's a tough angle there coming around. They're going to throw the paranoia through, but Meteor does not get clipped by it. Alex gets one, though. Oh, Alex, he can't afford to take that much damage. I was going to say he has the HP advantage, but now he does not. He's going to drop down the right click. Would get a kill. Needs to line it up. He cannot make it happen. Meteor will get those extra kills coming through, funneling the ult orbs into Xe. That means he's going to go ahead and draws it out, but instantly does get shut down by this panel. Onyx is going to manage to follow up for a second kill now onto Hate, and yeah, it looks like this is just going to be the rifle round going the way of Noble. Their rifle round, I should say. Finally got the full buys in, and TS with just a ghost in hand. I mean, it would be an absolute miracle if he could turn this around and get a 1v4 clutch. All right, well, let's see if we can at least get one. If you can get one more kill out of it. Oh. Okay, there it is. The headshot. Right. That'll do. That'd be commit from the side of TNL. It's a great follow-up there by TS to smoke that off right away. Get the door closed. You know, get the information. On a TNL side, Xy comes out, gets one. Yeah, aggressive little push there, but it wasn't quite ready for that many people to be waiting for him over towards CT. So it does get taken out. Dart. That does spot you. Can't quite clear it out quickly enough. This and just might be a save now. That's what I'm Noble. thinking. You know, just sit back, try to pick them off as they exit the site, but otherwise, don't try to push in because this is basically unsalvageable. You can't afford to lose these guns. I mean, like I said, Revy was already broke at the beginning of this round. He literally had spent all of his credits. So, time to just back off, keep your rifles in hand. At least he upgraded. Yeah, that's true. Go to Bulldog the Vandal, <laughs> you know, as did Alex. So, it was the two people who I had like, Bulldogs. I like the half, the, you know, the cup half full here, man. <laughs> <laughs> Lockdown is available. Looks like Ana. Oh, he's trying to get aggressive. Goes for the, you know, the buzz play, the hold on play, whichever you want to call it. There's so many people who will uh, take credit for that sort of aggressive style. But he does get punished. Revy eliminated Lawrence down to 13 HP. It's only Meteor picked off now for the side of CNL thus far. But they're still starting to shift around the map. I mean, they can just go anywhere now. They know that the A side should be completely broken open. Yeah, I mean, they just completely shut down this mid push. I don't mind the idea here from Noble trying to change things up, trying to get aggressive. Trying to take control of the map, but they just don't execute. Uh, TNL's just better. I do mind it. Um, I mind it for the for the sake that Ana wasn't going in, you know, with the blade storm. He was going in with a vandal and, and like trying to get the jump on another flick. I mean, Xy doesn't even get touched by it. I I think that Ana genuinely was just kind of caught off guard that they were out, not that playing over towards Gelato, and that there was two of them there. Yeah. Um, but you know, either way. At least keeps it even, doesn't give his life up for nothing. So a 4v4. I think his timing was just a bit off, because I think he expected that smoke. And that, that, that grenade's going to come up just a bit short. But I think he expected that smoke there and was trying to get through it. No, no knives there. Okay, Alex and Revy doing some nice work here. Xe and Meteor are both going to be eliminated. Good catch from them, and now Alex situated here on the point. Pushes out, manages to find one. TS gets the headshot, however. And it's still going to be... Decently topped up. We'll go ahead and use the cosmic divide. Gets a plant down. The drone will move forward through this to try to get a dart onto him. Kind of an interesting little cosmic divide. Allows him to play both sides of boats here. Although he's going to get <laughs> spotted by the uh -oh. drone. And it is going to be Lawrence who's going to finish the <laughs> job. As he was sitting inside of the astral floor for a second. And I don't know. Typical jet things here on defense. Press push forward. The drone is there, but I guess they just don't quite communicate that he's around the corner fast enough. Third ball out from X. He does manage to find that blind, gets the kill, but now there's going to be three waiting for him over towards CT. Is he prepared for the second? Shots do not connect, so he just managed to push it on the back of that flash. I love the way he did that, too. Doesn't throw the flash over towards Revy, throws it behind himself. Just guarantee that he'll get that flash and won't get flashed himself. Still does get eliminated by Yudotana at the end of the day, as we are in a 2v2, but... Yudotan, he's the one who kind of has to lead the charge. Let's use the weapon swap. We will. It's over to a bulldog, so he says, let me get something a little bit better. <laughs> and the lockdown will get burned by him. Yeah, just going to buy some time here. There's nothing that Ana or Udotan can really do uh, about this lockdown, of course. There's no Hunter's Fury or anything like that available. Going to get an immediate dash in from Ana, trying to push through in a boat. Hate is ready, though. Going to get the kill and the fox. That kind of peak, you know exactly where they're at. Um, it's really safe. Wow. 
now is an instant shutdown. And Lawrence comes up with one of his own. Headshots galore here from the Sheriffs. But Lawrence will fall at the end of the day. But still a good pickup. Unicorn TPing into the back. Just can't recover his weapon fast enough after throwing the paranoia. Does get eliminated. Yet again, we see Exit pulling it off brilliantly. As he finds three kills on the round, does he get up that wall? Coming down. Oh, the spray through the smoke. Lawrence just rips Petey to shreds. Really nicely done. Check on extra couple darts out there. See if he can find any damage. See if he can find any recon here for his squad. Yeah, I Doesn't think... Doesn't uh, do much, but it's a great pick. I think Meteor is going to need to pick up his jaw off the floor off of that one for sure. Yeah. Oh, this lurk oh. at wine. Could be absolutely be brutal here. He thought he goes for the spray. Well, he misses initially, but the rocket off screen from Revy manages to find two with the showstopper. A huge performance from him in the round. As if push comes in, Hate does manage to find the headshot on Ana. Now in a 1v3. But he is low. His break through. Hate finds one. He needs an ace to close it. Won't happen. Down Revy. Her ball goes in. He's charging in with the smoke. Oh, the timing is not super great there. Ooh. At all. He's going to have to be frustrated there with TS, perhaps. Now, counter lockdown going to be used. The aggressive push here onto the site. Revy will get punished as Hate is doing it yet again. Manages to find two. Meteor now going to be eliminated. It's just Hate by himself. He's got three kills yet again. Does he find a fourth? Echo in the back. He's trying to set these lineups. Hate finds four. Keep eyes on him. Oh, Ana wraps around the back. Does finally manage to finish him off. There's only a few daggers left, but they're just shooting straight through the wall. Now the Hunter's Fury comes in, and Echo will get in this area. We just got to show off our sweet pillar LEDs. Sweet pillars. Yeah. <laughs> XE with a nice little deep charge here into the back. Man, just find Alex, then we'll snap back over. Get his HP back, but two members now gone on the side of TNL. As Noble try to close out this final round of the half, make it 8 to 4. Spike got. So it wouldn't be a great count by them, but now they have to retake the site. Max, he's still just lurking over here in the back of it. And it's the fine one, but Lawrence Coe's charging in. He's at four kills in the round, but now so is Exy. And does he find the ace? It's just him versus Revy, who's making his way through Alley right now. It's just not even fair. He's trying to clear the site. I mean, he thinks that he's already there, and oh, he cannot make it happen. Will beat the Indiana Jones, etc. Indiana Jones, all right. Original trilogy Star Wars, perhaps, you know, then we're good. All right, shots <laughs> out here as v Lobby has just been, uh, this is a killing field this entire series so far. So the last pistol round now here again at the beginning. Uh, it's just Noble getting to see one Sheriff there. The rest is classic. Oh, throws. Uh, Throughout the Nanosaur, but okay, okay, just spray and pray. Wins it out. He finds a fourth. Do I see a fifth? He's charging for it. He's feeling it, but he's not going to get it. You know what I mean? Again, denies. <laughs> Especially if this rifle round doesn't go their way, then they're just, then you have a really, really, really tough road ahead. Oh, I think I think the road comes to an end. I think, I think I, you're I think, right. I think this, that's when that's when you're driving. You see the sign that comes up. It says yeah, dead end. Dead end. You're like, uh oh, yeah. I went the wrong way. All right, or this is a cul-de-sac. Yeah, well, it's oh. going bad. Oh no. Okay. Oh no. Well, Xy manages to find one. Hasn't recovered. A weapon, though, so still is going to be holding on to the Spectre. As I say that, there you go, Vandal in hand! It snaps onto Ana's head, and it's just Revy versus the world right now. Push coming in, Axie gets him yet again, three kills. And so it's hard to kind of put him up there because he hasn't gotten the opportunities to get deep into these rounds, and he's just holding an angle. Uh, you, okay, okay. Yudotan. Yeah, there's the lineup, and that's going to be a Vandal recovered now into the hands of Ana. And he's going to put it to good use very swiftly there as TS will get picked off. Follows up now onto Echo. They've broken down the defenses here of TNL, but Exy is still in the lobby. So anything is possible. Four members left alive. Pushes the corner, but Ana's ready for him. Three kills, now just Meteor. Holding on to the Spectre. Pushing forward into market. Nobody's really staring through here yet, but Lawrence goes for the peak. Bolt is out. Oh, he throws down the cloud burst. Manages to somehow not die to that spray. Here's the dash. Swaps out the weapon. Takes the tail. Went out. Says, okay. I've recovered money in their pockets, so they could definitely make it just a little run. But they have to get through Meteor. And oh, Lawrence, he goes for the long peak. Dashing forward. Ana trying to go in with the Blade Storm. Will just get shot down. Nathan does manage to find, uh, you know, Xyz ult. Leaves him at 20 HP. But now, yeah, it's just the, the swift turnaround. Yeah, it's because they didn't identify the the operator they, they they lost two players early to it from yeah. meteor and you know they tried to get into his face i think you know anna's i think instinct there was 
And it's, you know, a couple rifles, a Bulldog and a Spectre for the side of Noble. And Curveball comes in, actually pushes through, manages to find one, Hank gets another. He's trying to line it up, finally does catch Lawrence. It's being a little tricky for him, but 5-2. to two. They're going to make a go for it, for sure. Eight, watching this door. He's going to get one more. Is that the second? No, Revy's going to get him at go. It's all poison. It all, it's all hard to go through. Yep. Eliminated X. He's finding that opening kill. Gets a second one, a third. Oh, he does it again. The man's doing it again. Can he line up the fourth? Of course he can. He's Xy. It's a flaw. Just slow up this approach. Clears out the Seekers. Clear out the Trailblazer as well. But they still make their way over here to the Pyramid Stacks. Con, blind, just trying to spray through. The Poison Wall comes down and Hate finds the opening frag. Is Con will fall. It's going to be the healing gone as Meteor is just taking these shots. Dashes over to the side. Trying to stay alive. Another blind coming in, but now Xy will fall. Hate still playing around the back. The rest of the squad is just scooping up the kills. He'll push. Fuck gets the final shot. He's getting forward. It's that Toxic Wall does come off. Lawrence. Oh. Taking just a little bit of damage there in the decay. Just helps take him down. TS finds the kill. Alex falling just moments before that. TS will follow up for a second. And there you go. It's just going to be a flawless round. A bit of a slower one there for TS. As those potentially come through on this map. Oh, yep. They get, the, they get the read, they hit the spot. He Even never though saw that it. tracking expires, they still know, and, you know, roughly where his position is going to be, so the spray through manages to find the kill. Spike now going to be planted, and this is one hell of a retake attempt that's going to be needed for Noble. If they want to stem the bleeding, but Alex now going to fall. Hate stabilizes, will go ahead and take the dismiss out. And just like that, in the blink of an eye, it's just Ana left his own devices. He's lurking around, trying to in the gun usage. Lawrence. Oh, he's trying to get aggressive. Oh. oh, no, he got flashed. He almost managed to slip right by. If he had, could have gotten around that wall just a little bit faster, he might have managed to make it happen, but does get taken out. Ana, with the Blade Storm, does manage to find Echo. That's a lot of that post point utility now gone. Here, we're finding Ulukan. Boosting up over top of the smoke. Spots another one. Tries to line it up. Gets a knife in the TS, but it's not enough to pitch him off. Takes it down to the DHP. Shots flying, but X, he's got three on the round, and that's six straight. It's a couple shots, and then does reveal his position, and now he's darted. You know, he's exa exactly where he's at. In the back of the B site. We'll strike him down. He does get a little bit of trade damage, though, as Echo does get eliminated. So 2v3 with the spike getting planted. Meteor starting to move back around, checking over towards the attacker spawn, but won't manage to see anything. That makes his way over towards mid and could get a very nice back angle here. On a Yudotan. Oh, they have no idea he's coming. TS even gets Ana over and Arches. Things falling apart quickly. That's gonna get a bit aggro. Comes charging through. They have the spot. Blades will take down Alex and that is gonna be the Viper all burned for not a lot gain. So Echo's my MVP right now. He's getting so many great spots. Yeah. Here. He's playing oh. That's nuts. Okay, Meteor's my MVP now. <laughs> <laughs> it's all it takes. <laughs> Single headshot. You millennials and your spitting. instant gratification. <laughs> all right, well, how's that for okay, you? Okay, a bit oh, of extended oh, oh, gratification. You're not. You're, you're a Viper. You can't be playing that far forward. Yeah. Okay, Yorotan. Does manage to find hate. It's a really strong start. Now, Alex gets XC. That's the two top fraggers. Other than Meteor now eliminated. And speaking of Meteor, goes straight back in. Tries to level the playing field just a bit. So the counterpart Jet Lawrence spots him from the side. Gets that elimination. Now it's just TS and Echo. How much post plant util do they have between them? That's one shock bolt out. Yudathan still quite healthy in that. They need to get him off this. It's not gonna be good oh. enough. Yeah. When do we get the when do we get the animation about all the, the random bears and penguins and stuff that are going uh, someday I'm feeling it. Oh <laughs> man, well Echo's gonna open up with the operator of his own. Meteor looking over the wall, Ooh. seeing and he is gonna get one. Yep, the double up updraft gets him line of sight on the Yudatan. Finds the elimination, gets a reset on the knives, comes charging around the other side of the poison wall, tries to line up onto Alex, can't quite make it happen, but Hate will find the kill. It does end up costing him, but now it's just Ana. Ana's lonesome. Finds CS, but Echo with a final shot. Adorable, and they deserve a raise. He taking a bit of damage, but oh man. Turns right around, man. Oh man, wall bang headshot to the sheriff. 
for one as Meteor is eliminated, and then Brevi is down to 16 HP. Doesn't manage to find Echo, though. Suddenly, it's a 2v1. Spikes down yeah. right at the front of back B as well. I mean, this is very, 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 very difficult for Revy here. Let go. The shock. See if he catches anything. Nobody yet follows up with the recon. But a flash around the corner should get him. Oh, we'll take this 2-0. And, and you can already see here that the, the Viper, you know, the Toxic screen is basically the same from Noble as what TNL does. But the, it's, a, it's, a, it's a deep going to be right down mid here for TNL as they are watching the cross angles. Oh, Ooh, good shot here by Revy with the Sheriff. Yeah, head was still exposed, but now they're just moving right into the meat grinder. Echo waiting for them with a Vandal. They just charge.